So you want to buy your first greenhouse. Where? Online or a big box store? In this video, I'm going to review eight places you can buy a starter greenhouse for about $300 or less US. Okay, some ground rules. This has got to be a decent sized greenhouse. We're talking about 200 square feet. There needs to be some sort of operable door. There has to be a way to vent the heat. And you and a tall friend need to be able to stand up inside. So to summarize, 200 square feet, door, ventable, and stand up inside. That's a good start. So let's see what you can get and what it costs from some of the most popular retailers today. Simple Tech, that's the name of this channel. And we have piles of other free videos on growing and greenhouse technology you can check out just by hitting that free subscribe button after watching this video. A $300 greenhouse kit isn't going to last you forever. If you're lucky, you'll get a few seasons out of it. But eventually the plastic will break, a big wind will tear or destroy it, or you're just going to decide to spend a few thousand dollars and get a proper, bigger greenhouse. But it's a start, and you got to start somewhere. And there's nothing to say you can't invest some more money and beef up any of these greenhouse kits so they'll last longer or be stronger for harsher environments. Most of these kits are designed for a first time user growing in their backyard. Think of them as a step up from an open air garden. Yes, it's possible to DIY these greenhouses cheaper too, but this video is just about buying and assembling a cheap kit from a store or online website. What's interesting is how many look alike from different retailers. So the last greenhouse reviewed will be directly from China, where all the cheap greenhouses seem to be made. Home Depot has a few options in the $300 greenhouse price range. The unit that stands out to me is the 10 by 26 by 7 foot greenhouse with 12 windows and ventilation screens by Outsunny. This greenhouse is a whopping 260 square feet. It's on the larger side and currently lists for, get this, $203.70. That's the regular price too, not even a sale price. It's got a roll-up door. You can't expect more than a roll-up door for 200 bucks. And what they call a heavy-duty powder-coated steel frame. It has many venting windows, as you can see in the pictures. This greenhouse is an ideal way to extend your growing season and protect your plants from large temperature swings in the spring and the fall. Lots of space for minimum dollars. And a great way to start growing inside. Lowe's doesn't seem to be on the same page as everyone else when it comes to cheap greenhouses. Their contender is 15 feet by 6 feet, or about 90 square feet, for more money than Home Depot, with Lowe's asking $254 for a greenhouse almost one-third the size as the one from Home Depot. Quality, honestly, I don't know. I like the tent pegs designed for extra stability. That's a nice feature but they look like cheap plastic and they're straight, not corkscrew shaped. So they will probably pull out easy in a big wind. It's possible this greenhouse is stronger than all the rest in this review. Possible, but I seriously doubt it. As of this video posting date, my advice, if you have to buy from Lowe's, is to wait and see if they get anything in that's bigger and cheaper at a later date. I say take a pass on their current budget greenhouse inventory that they have listed online. Walmart has a solid greenhouse available for $229. It's 10 foot by 20 feet, making it a large 200 square feet inside, has a roll-up door and zippable windows for venting. It's 7 feet tall at the peak, making it easy for a number of full-size adults to stand up inside. The ground stakes are metal and twisted, corkscrew style, making them seem like they could actually hold some serious amount of tension in the ground and withstand a decent windstorm. For a first greenhouse, this is a good option and one worth checking out for novice gardeners looking to cover their plants. What's nice is most everyone is close to a Walmart 
And if for some reason you aren't close to a Walmart, they'll even ship it to you. I also think the quality is pretty decent here too, as Walmart allows you to return anything junky easily, and that weeds out most crappy products pretty fast. Menards is a hardware store, and I love going there. But in this comparison, Menards doesn't seem to be really in the cheap greenhouse market. Their best option for this comparison is an 8 by 8 foot greenhouse, 64 square feet, that just doesn't compare to what we've seen from other places so far. The worst part is, this 8 by 8 greenhouse is a whopping $375. With what I've shown you so far, this isn't worth your time. I hope Menards steps up their entry-level greenhouse game soon, as they often have some amazing deals on some really cool stuff. But when it comes to this comparison, they are way behind all the other retailers. Next, I go over a few online-only retailers. And starting with eBay, I'm going to focus on new products only. Of course, you can buy used on eBay, but this is about comparing apples to apples. So we're only going to talk about new greenhouses here. eBay offers a 10 by 20 foot greenhouse. That's pretty sweet. It looks well built, roll up door, closable windows, seven foot ceiling. The best part is eBay is offering this greenhouse brand new for $218. Yeah, that's just over 200 bucks. For a starter greenhouse, this is a pretty decent price, but there's one problem. eBay often charges more for shipping, and this can vary depending upon where you live. That can be a problem, as we really don't know the final price then. Depending on the shipping costs, this can be a great deal or a very expensive greenhouse compared to the other retailers out there. That being said, eBay is always worth a look. And don't forget to add the shipping cost to anything you might want to buy there when comparing. Wayfair, you got just what I need. Okay, I'm not getting any singing gigs with that voice. But Wayfair has a pretty good greenhouse that needs to be considered here. They have free shipping, but that's not even the best part. The best part is their entry-level greenhouse has a peaked roof. Everyone else in this comparison uses a Quonset or curved roof dome greenhouse. Now, curved roofs are okay, but if you're going to get any snow where you live, a peaked roof is much better at handling that. Also, a peaked roof allows for easy install of gutters, which is a great upgrade, as most gardeners agree, rainwater is the best water to use on your plants. You get all that for $219.99. Yep, that's it. $220 for a peaked roof, 200 square foot greenhouse that has a zippered door and windows for venting. Who would have thought Wayfair had just what I need? There is no fair comparison without mentioning Amazon. I think everyone can agree just how big a retailer Amazon is. So how does Amazon rank in this entry-level greenhouse comparison? Well, somewhere in the middle, to be honest. They offer a decent 10 by 20 foot, 200 square foot greenhouse with a zipper door and ventable windows. If you're a Prime member, and who isn't these days, you get free shipping too. It comes in at $279.99, so a little bit higher in price but still a reputable retailer on a decent entry-level greenhouse. I say decent because the price isn't super fantastic, but it's not terrible either. It's decent. A reasonable value for the money, but not the very best deal on the marketplace. If you live where the greenhouse needs to be shipped to you, Amazon seems to have some of the best shipping practices around, and that might make this offer stand out above the others. Okay, by far the most options available to buy an entry-level greenhouse exist on Alibaba.com. There seems to be an endless amount of manufacturers making tank greenhouses, and if you look around a bit, the prices are better than one can imagine. 
I found one place offering a 10 by 20 foot greenhouse, 200 square feet for $72. Yep, that's right. 72 bucks. There is one problem though. Shipping is almost always extra. And with a large item like a greenhouse, shipping can be expensive. Mind you, considering how much you're going to save, it still might be advantageous to look into this option, even though most manufacturers are in China and shipping can often take months to get to you. If you're going to sell these greenhouses, this is where you need to begin looking. As the prices often get better, the more units you buy and the shipping cost per unit will go down with multiple units as well. So that's it. Home Depot right now has what seems like the best deal online or box store for an entry level greenhouse. If you like this comparison, then you need to check out some of our other videos on the Simple Tech channel. We have piles of free videos on greenhouses and growing technology.